It is about 20 past midnight here in St. Petersburg, Russia. You can see that the sun has not set, nor will it. This is one of the last so-called white nights here. We are that far up north. And if you look over there on the horizon, you'll see that tall spire. That's the headquarters for the Gazprom uh, company. That is the tallest building here in Europe. And just to the right of it is the St. Petersburg Soccer Stadium. Now, I'll be there tonight. We're talking several hours from now to watch Argentina take on Nigeria to see who will advance to the next round of the World Cup a soccer tournament. And this is also a chance for soccer star Lionel Messi of Argentina to redeem himself. Many fans feel like that he has not had a very good showing in this World Cup. And this is also an opportunity for Russia to show itself again to the international community to foreigners. There's a lot of foreigners here and foreigners like me. Now, the last time I was here, Russia was called the USSR. That's my brother and I. We are somewhere in the middle of Siberia. Uh, we ended up traveling to Moscow. And in 1980s Moscow, the only indication that there was a Western influence was the Pepsi stand outside our interest state-run hotel. That was it. Today you come to St. Petersburg, there's a Four Seasons Hotel, and there's American fast food. We saw Mickey D's, Subway, KFC. And you take a look at this. This is a Volga, a Russian-made automobile. It was commonplace back then, I'm sure it is in some other parts of the country today in St. Petersburg. It's considered to be a classic automobile, something that us tourists were taking our pictures next to. And then you look over there, and there's a Range Rover. All I'm suggesting is that the standard of living has gotten better for a number of people here in this country. Now you can check me out on Twitter at BobNBC. I'll be posting scenes from right over there at the St. Petersburg Soccer Stadium for match 39. Again, that is tonight. Dobre Nishe from St. Petersburg. I hope I said that right.